Hello and welcome to my channel. I have created an updated ADP deck list uh, using the cards that are available in the chilling rain. So let's look at the deck profile for the deck list that I have created. I'm playing two Crobat V with the uh, drastic draw ability. So it will help us draw six cards in our hand. I'm playing two ADP. It is our main focus as ADP has got altered creation GX attack that will help us do 30 more damage and gonna help us take one more price card if we attack like a single price pokemon then two price cards will be taking and something like that i'm playing one ld v it has got happy match ability so it will help when we play it from the bench then it helps us grab a supporter from our discard pile so it was really good in one of the matchups that i had i'm playing cricketone v it has got exciting stage so once during your turn you may draw cards until you have three cards in your hand if this pokemon is in the active sword you may draw cards until you have four cards in your hand instead of uh, like three cards so this is really good goes good with the peony that we that i'll be playing i'm playing two dead in a gx one edge slash v so that i can combat against desert y which are Going around, going around in the new standard format, I'm playing one Marmile, four Asian, three Cherish Ball, one Echoing Horn. So it will help us put a basic Pokemon from your opponent's discard pile onto their bench. So we'll be in the end game, we will be able to boss up that Pokemon and do the damage and get the victory. I'm playing two Energy Spinner, four Energy Switch, one Great Catcher, four Metal Saucer, four Quick Ball. 3 switch, 1 tool scrapper, 1 chaotic swirl to combat against those the nasty part to the peak. I'm playing 4 bosses orders, 2 peony, discard your hand and search your deck for up to 2 trainer cards, reveal them and put them into your hand then shuffle your deck. So this is the one of the best supporters that I'm playing and it is good for good pairing with our ADP. I'm playing 3 professors research. 1 air balloon, 1 rusted sword, 8 metal energy and 3 water energy. So let's look at some of the matches that I had with this deck. So in the first match I am going first. I have got Vazation and he has got Eternatus V. I have benched Marvile so I am just gonna grab his Sgalarian Zigzagoon and look at his hand. So he is playing weakness guard energy. So... I grab myself ADP with the Cherish Ball. So I'm thinking of using Energy Spinner to attach the Water Energy to my ADP. And I'm just going to use Intrepid Sword ability. And I grab myself 2 Metal Energy. So I was thinking that if I grab myself 1 more Metal Energy with Peony, then I will be able to eliminate Eternatus V and grab easy price cards so that was my thinking so let's see if I am able to do that or not because our opponent looks like a good player and he discards the what you may call it dark energy and I think he'll be grabbing himself Moltres for that so okay so he switches into Zigzagoon Okay, okay, not a bad play on my opponent's part. So now I'm thinking of doing Altered Creation GX and with Peony, I think I'm going to grab myself Energy Switch and I think I was just looking at my deck, whatever I needed. So I had one Metal Energy, but I needed to... I'm thinking of grabbing switch and possibly grabbing metal saucer like energy switch is better because I'll be able to switch energies so with that I'm just gonna use e switch and I'm gonna switch the metal to my ADP and use the cricket tunes ability so I'm just gonna attach to is gonna attach to what you may call it Zacian 
or it's better to adapt to ADP. So I'm just gonna use altered creation GX attack and next turn I'll be able to eliminate the what you may call it Crobat V because I have got boss's orders. So he is using Eternatus V Max. He just evolved into Eternatus V, so he is grabbing Zigzagoon. He's gonna ping Zigzagoon and gonna ping the ADP. So Crobat V, okay, okay. So let's see, let's see what you're gonna do, my friend. What you're gonna do? Great ball, okay. He still needs to fill his whole bench. With that, he will be able to do 270 damage, and he has already used Crobat once. So he can't go back again. So he's gonna Pokecom. Okay, Eternatus V Max. So what you gonna grab? Are you gonna grab another Eternatus? Okay, Yavitel. Okay, okay. Let's see, let's see. Professor's research. Okay, so he's gonna discard all these resources. Attaches to Eternatus V Max. Okay, okay. Pokecom Eternatus V. Okay. Galarian Zigzagoon. Okay, gonna ping my ADP. Okay, he still needs one card to eliminate us. So he does 270 damage, but he still needed one card. So I'm just gonna boss up the Crobat V, I suppose. And gonna use Metal Saucer. Gonna attach to Marvile. Just gonna use Cricket Tune exciting stage so i'll be able to draw two more cards gonna pen Zacian. gonna attach to this new Zacian and gonna use ultimate ray so i eliminate the crowbat and i have got three metal energies so i'm thinking of attaching two to this Zacian and one to this Zacian. so because i will be able to if I grab myself metal fossil, then I'll be able to attach to what you may call it this that Zacian as well. So let's see what my opponent is gonna do. So he's gonna promote the Tenetus V Max, and this time around he will be able to eliminate us. Okay, dread end. Not a bad play on my opponent's part. Okay. So let's see. Let's see. So I'm just gonna promote the Cricket Dune. And just gonna use metal saucer. I'm gonna attach to this station. And uh, just thinking of using Zacian. And gonna bench the Dedene because I was thinking of using Boss rather than use Peony. And gonna metal saucer that. Quick ball away the Zacian. Now I'm gonna grab myself Eldegoss so that I can ensure that I grab the boss from the discard pile. And gonna just gonna boss up so he gives us the victory. So let's look at the second matchup that I had with this deck. In the second matchup I have got Dedene in the active position. And let's see he has got fire decks box so let's see what he's playing. I'm not sure because he's taking a long time to do anything. Okay, he promotes. So what it is, let's see. So he has got Mulligan and with that I grab three cards. That's a lot of cards. Okay. Okay, so he's playing Center Scorch V and he has put down Volcanion. Okay. So I'm just gonna grab myself a ADP. And just gonna metal saucer to ADP. Just gonna attach rusted sword. Just gonna promote. Just gonna go into ADP. Just gonna use energy spinner. And just gonna miss it and gonna use crowbat V. Okay, so if I was going second, then I could have used my attacks, but I'm going first so. I was thinking of grabbing the Marvile, but Marvile is priced, so that's okay, that's okay. So I did grab myself really good resources. So even if he knocks out my energy, 
with radiating heat i'll be able to use peony that was my thinking with peony i'll be able to grab myself energy spinner or water energy and gonna attach to my adp and gonna be able to use altered creation gx attack next turn around and i told and show us a easy game so let's see what my button is going to do so he's attaches to vulcanian and i don't understand what the game plan of my opponent is okay so i think he's gonna like use mallow and lana to go into vulcanian and gonna attach to center scorch v and he uses dead energy x okay and he has got fire this that is a different fire energy which i did use in my adp not in my adp sorry i did use in my charizard v max deck list and it is not that viable of a deck even though charizard is a good pokemon so let's see let's see what okay he's going to grab victini v okay okay let's see let's see what you gonna do what you gonna do you're talking a long time okay flare starter okay flare starter so he attaches to what you may call it center scorch v so i was thinking of bossy mag of the charizard gonna do that only gonna boss up the charizard and i was thinking of using cherish ball to just avoid it and just gonna bench tedene and with that i grab myself energy so i'm just gonna use altered creation gx attack so i'll be able to eliminate anything that he promotes next turn around so let's see let's see does he have the welder to welder to the charizard okay he does have welder i tried ask for welder i was thinking so he has got two fire energy does he have the third fire energy to eliminate us with to not eliminate us but do 200 damage with his what you may call it i don't remember the gx attack i have not played charizard gx in a while charizard and rashid am gx in a while it is really viable in blessiflon deck list so he uses outrage okay he doesn't have the fire energy so just going to attach to zacian v and just going to promote zacian v and just going to use brave blade uh, because he is do because i'm doing 290 damage and i'll be able to grab myself four prize cards mawoil okay energy switch okay and cherish ball okay and water energy so two of our water energies were prized okay if he had used center scorch we then we would initially then radiating heat then we would not be able to use altered creation gx attack but he didn't do it so we we were in a good spot and he yeah, i can just boss up the dead end and eliminate it and i can get the victory so let's see what center scorch is doing let's see let's see so what you going to do my dude what you going to do you're taking a long time okay bird keeper so victini v okay victini victini who is really really chini victini let's see let's see let's see what you going to do okay switch into Center Scorch V Max, so G Max Inferno. Okay, so as we had weakness, so he eliminates my Zacian, but that's okay. We are in a commanding position. I have got Boss in my hand, so I can eliminate him. So just gonna bench the Mawile. So he doesn't have anything. So let's gonna boss up this Dead End and gonna use Ultimate Ray. So. with that i get the victory in this matchup 
and let's look at the third matchup that I played using this deck. So in the third matchup, I have got Zacian in the active position, which is the best start that I have, and he is playing Mew. So let's see what my opponent is gonna do, and what my opponent is playing. So Cherish Paul, okay, is he playing ADP? Okay, Dedene GX. So it might be an ADP deck list. Might be. I'm not sure. Yeah, it looks like ADP decklist because he has, okay, yeah, it is ADP and that's okay. So escape rope, he's going to go into ADP, I think so. Yeah, and going to use intrepid sword to grab himself resources. So just going to quick ball away the quick ball. Going to grab myself Marvel. So let's see what my opponent is playing. So he has got no resources that he requires. He has got energy spinner, so but no energy at all. So uh, just quick ball away the energy and just gonna grab myself ADP and just gonna use cherish paul gx to grab myself dead na i suppose just gonna boss up the mew so he won't be able to switch because i didn't see any switch cards in my opponent's hand so i do have the water energy just gonna using trapper sword so i did grab myself the metal energy that i required so i'll be able to use altered creation gx attack next turn around and i have i'm in a commanding position i have got bosses orders okay so he has got metal saucer okay energy spinner water energy okay okay not a big issue so let's see, let's see what my opponent is going to do. Does he have the switch card? Escape rope, okay. So I'm thinking of using Alter Creation GX. So I promote the ADP. Does he have the saucer? Okay. A dead end a GX, okay. So he's going to use Great Catcher. So let's see, let's see. So he uses great catches my dead energy X. Okay. So let's see, let's see. Let's see what you're gonna do, dude. What you gonna do? What you gonna do, my friend? You're taking a long time, my friend. Okay, so he doesn't have the resources that he required. Okay. So this is a thing where. The person who does his altered creation GX attack first is gonna win. So I grab the metal energy. Uh, he gives us the victory because he knows that he'll lose. And when you are going up against an ADP deck, so you should know that the person who does the eight, like altered creation GX attack first gets the victory. So he knew that and he lost the last. He lost it and. It is a really good deck. A lot of people are playing Moltres and uh, Zapdos in this deck list, but I don't like the deck list that they have uh, they have created. I like my deck list. So do try this deck deck list out for yourself with the updated Chilling Rain cards. And thanks for watching and bye for now.